What is up guys, this is something I've been wanting to do for a while since I started my channel basically, is make a um, little guide to Rome Total War Tactics. And um, I got a basic Rome Total, I mean Roman Army that you start off with, Basic Legion. And I got some Gauls that you would be basically starting off facing. Um, so I'm very hard. So, let's get started. And I'll show you how to set up your armies and all that good stuff. It's going to be a long series. Um, I'm going to be doing that's not really. Good. This is going to be a long series. Uh, um hmm. I don't know why I'm fighting here, but it'll have to do. Where what you want to do is get um make sure all your units are on shield wall. Keep them on firewall, fair wheel. Then you, your second line, which is your better troops, which is in chest pawns, go first. As my friends always say. Um, okay. You want to have these guys, this, alright, off skirmish mode. Then you want one of these guys, two on each flank. Okay, you need your archers on the back flank. Your guy behind, right behind the second line. Commander, commander. Then your cavalry back there. Yes, Imperator. Forward, move. Okay. Then with these guys. Since you're not fighting Carthage, which you don't need to keep these in reserve, like if you fight an elephants, I'll explain this later in better detail, but you want to keep them behind your, um, Slingers. Okay, let's start it. And I got my general, which is basically the general that's, I don't know, he didn't mean to get him gold, but... The general you start off with when in the Gallic region. Here's their army. Those are like the stuff they usually spam. And don't move your cavalry because they'll use the, you move their units and they'll mess up the whole line. And you want them to charge your infantry. And they'll send a group off, charge your cavalry, and it'll you know hitting you from the sides, which you don't want. And normally you would want to take every advantage you have, but I'm just showing you a standard battle, all that good stuff. The next person we're going to be fighting is someone you'll either Macedon or Macedonia or um, Carthage, which are the people you'll use. You start off fighting basically, the first three factions you'll fight base at first are Carthage, um, Macedonia, Greece, really, but. But I'm, I'm going to use Macedonia since they're better phalanx to show you how to beat phalanxes and stuff. And maybe later on I'll show you how to use phalanxes to your advantage. But no, Carthage, Gaul, and Macedonia. Slash Greece. Alright, you want to keep, keep these guys, your slingers, parallel to their cavalry. Because slingers do good against cavalry. You'll see them dropping like flies soon. See, slingers are really good against cavalry, and they're good to hide in the woods and all that good stuff. Yeah, you're not feeling so secure on the hill now, are you? Okay, is there anywhere else engaged? 
And your goal, not really a goal, but a good strategy is to attack the general on the goal thing if it charges you. Make sure you get all your slingers because it's normally going to be a um, captain or general, be a cavalry unit if there's one in. If it's a general, it's going to be a cavalry unit. If there's a cavalry unit, that's not missile in the um, army, and it's, and it's a captain army, it's going to be. Um, let's see, uh, the cavalry unit. You want to. Chase to use um arch. You never want to charge cavalry into infantry, but you want to charge it into ma mass missile and use it as flanking. Charge them from the back. So just uh, keep their um their missile units running. You want it to be nice and all that good stuff. And why I had you group these guys up, these on um, your second line, shit, is so. Uh, okay, hold on. All right, so you can um. Once all the lines are engaged, you want to turn them on fire at will. You get back there. Make sure once after the skirmish mode. All right. Now you engage them, and you while they're engaged. Okay, all the lines are engaged, so you want to get these guys on fire. Well, that's their general, which he'll usually charge in. Want to get these guys from behind? Once you see the line starting to be pushed back, you want to hit them. And use one cavalry unit. If you usually have two, one cavalry unit to flip chase units once they start routing. And the other one to hit them from behind, keep hitting them from behind because they'll usually mass route. They're, they're good as their general. And with it, their morale. Don't let your units start running after the units. And the thing about Roman units is they're so flexible. That's how you, they can really easily beat any phalanx unit or any horde unit because they can just easily get behind them and surround them Once they break, they're gonna not be hit you hard. You can just run into individual units. And always use cavalry to ch chase down skirmishers who are on skirmish mode. I like this. Uh, So once they all start running, you want to reverse your thing. Keep the same one who's chasing units, cavalry unit, who's chasing units, and the one who's flanking um to hit the skirmishers. All right, where's the skirmisher? The forest archers. Hit you from behind. You can keep changing it up. Just use your cavalry wisely. What I'm basically trying to say. Once you have them from your 
run off from your starting position, you basically... And you never want to, when fighting barbarians, have to use your general, really, to the point as a cavalry unit. You always just want to keep him a missile unit. Because if, that, if you need him to make a difference, you need to um, just refight the battle or use different tactics. I don't know. We yeah, you, if you know what I mean. You know what I'm saying. Concerned about hunting cavalry. Sorry about this environment, it's not really friendly. And Kane, there you have it. Let's look at the score resolution. In battle? You don't really want to continue the battle, but for sure purposes. Alright, they killed. We got that many men remaining. Alright, see so you guys like see you in the next video. And I'm gonna promote this video on YouTube with spend some little money to promote it and Oh, if you're watching it, subscribe, and you're new, subscribe, and all that good stuff. Comment, rate, and tell me who you want me to fight next, or who any tips you want. I'm going to be doing campaign and all that good stuff. Campaign map, and skills, and all that, and economics. Just if you're having any trouble with anything in the medieval to, um, not necessarily medieval. I'm going to be doing some medieval mods, but Rome Total War. Just message me or comment in the below.